McLaren Honda driver Stoffel Van Dorn earned a seventh-place finish to equal his best Formula One career result at the Malaysia Grand Prix. The 25-year-old Belgian called it my best drive in Formula One up until now and said that the effort he's been putting in has been paying off massively after his first visit to Supping. Having qualified 7th on the grid for the race, his best grid position in F1 so far, with a flawless lap in Q3 to beat Nico Hülkenberg, Sergio Perez and teammate Fernando Alonso, Van Dorn said on Saturday to qualify 7th on a circuit like this is probably about as good as it gets for us, so I'm very happy with my performance. We generally tend to be better over a single lap than across a race stint, so I think tomorrow will be tougher for us, but at least we're in a position to race. With two Williams on his right side and a pair of Force Indias on his left going into Turn 1, Van Dorn hung onto his place stoutly on the opening lap, though Sergio Perez kept on his tail and took fifth place from Van Dorn on lap 8. Perez himself battled an illness through the weekend and produced a stellar performance himself to finish sixth. His Force Indias pace was too much for the McLaren. Perez finished best of the rest behind the top three teams and was the last driver to finish on the opening lap, and Van Dorn could do little to realistically challenge the Mexican. Van Dorn pitted on lap 13 for soft tires, two laps after Felipe Massa and one lap after Lance Stroll, but when the McLaren driver exited the pits from his stop he emerged ahead of both Williams, which were seemingly dueling for position. Technical office Patty Lowe later clarified to Autosport that the Williams pair were executing team orders to let Stroll have the position ahead of Massa. Since Lance, who previously had the lead, ended up behind Felipe after the pit stops we felt it was correct to swap the places, explained Lowe. We also knew Felipe's car was carrying some damage after contact at the start of the race. Unfortunately, in the execution of that we lost a potential position to Van Dorn coming out of the pits. Van Dorn kept the gap ahead of Stroll just over two seconds until lap 48, when Stroll's tires began to drop off due to a lengthy stint and Van Dorn managed to keep his fellow rookie at bay by nearly 10 seconds at the flag. All weekend, I've been really strong and felt really confident with the car, said Van Dorn post-race. After qualifying 7th, we weren't really confident about where we'd finish in the race, so to pull off 7th today is an amazing result. I made a great start, we knew it was probably going to be difficult to hold off the Force Indias and the Williams behind, but only Perez came through. To finish 7th here, and to qualify 7th as well, just an extremely solid race. I had to push every lap, take care of the tires, and bring the car home. They were tough conditions out there, but we managed the gap with Lance Stroll very well, so I'm extremely happy. Having also finished 7th in Singapore, Van Dorn now sits 14th in the driver's standings with 13 points, two places ahead of teammate Alonso who has scored 10 in 2017 so far. This comes after a run of nine races without a point for Van Dorn, as he broke the deadlock in Hungary with a 10th place finish. The last races have been very, very good as well for me. I'm definitely working hard with the team, putting the pressure on, and it's good for the team spirit, continued Van Dorn after the Malaysia GP. This weekend shows that when everything falls more or less together, when we extract the most out of the car, great things are possible. And lately, even when things don't go 100% right, I'm still able to recover much better. All the effort I've been putting in is paying off massively. How do you rate Van Dorn's performance at the Malaysia GP? Have your say in the comment section below.